Hello, I'm Rakhi Rathod from the BMC Information Design and Development team. This video will show you how to configure provider actions in BMC Remedy with Smart IT. We will use Alan Albrook as the name of the administrator. Let's begin by logging into Smart IT. Alan logs into Smart IT. From the configuration menu, Alan selects screen configuration. In the configuration window, Alan wants to configure provider actions for the task view. So he clicks add remove actions to the right of the task view. In Smart IT, Alan wants to configure actions that will create an entry into the log file on the BMC Remedy IT Service Management Server. In the window for adding actions, by default, actions are in alphabetical order. However, you can define them in a custom order by using the custom order option. Alan prefers alphabetical order. To configure provider actions, he clicks add action. Under action type, he clicks provider actions. Alan selects the supported platform where the added action will be displayed. He can select the desktop, web, UC or mobile platforms, iOS and Android or both. Alan wants to configure actions for desktop and mobile platforms. In the action ID field, he enters a short text label for the provider action. Under open behavior, Alan clicks new browser window to open the action in a new browser. Under localize labels to show, Alan must select a supported language and add a label for the action. If the language that the system uses is not defined, then the default label new menu item is shown. Here he types log file entry as the label. This text will be shown under the more menu for the English locale. He clicks save to configure actions. This action will be applied to all new and existing tasks. In order to see the log entry, let us first create log1.txt file in BMC Remedy IT Service Management Server. In BMC Remedy Developer Studio, select the associated BMC Remedy ITSM server and log in to the Developer Studio. The server name is displayed in the AR System Navigator tab. From the list of server attributes, click All Objects. Right click Filters and select New Filter. In the Associated Forms section, click Add. Under Filtering Options, type in the name field and click OK. Under Execution Options, select the service checkbox. In the run if qualification, build a query with the action name is equal to attributes. And click OK. In the if action pane, right click add action and select log file. Browse for the BMC Remedy ITSM server where the log entry will be stored. Provide a name log1.txt and click open. Save all and provide a filter name and click OK. So now we have set a provider action. Let's see how it is displayed on the Smart IT interface. Alan opens an incident. You can see the more menu here. Alan selects log entry file. A message confirming successful execution of the action is displayed. In the log1.txt file, we can see the created log. I hope this video has helped you learn how to configure provider actions. For more information, 
refer to our online documentation on docs.bmc.com. Thank you for watching.